Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. When manipulating your document in Word, you may find that you need to navigate through your document. Word makes this easy by using the navigation pane. This pane allows you to search your document and also select and move text that has a heading style applied to it. To access and view the navigation pane, click the View tab in the ribbon. In the Show button group, check the Navigation Pane checkbox to turn the Navigation Pane both on and off. By default, the Navigation Pane is docked at the left side of the application window. However, you can move it if needed. The first item in the Navigation Pane is the Search Document Search field. Here is where you can enter any terms that you would like to search for within your document. Word will immediately enact a search. Clicking the downward facing arrow on the right side of the search field will give you options on how and what to search for in your document. For example, you could choose footnotes slash endnotes to search your document for any footnotes or endnotes it may contain. The navigation pane also allows you to see all of the text that has been assigned a heading style. Below the search field you will see headings, pages, and results tab titles. Clicking any of these titles will display that item. As mentioned above, the Headings tab will display all of the text assigned one of the heading styles. There may be a time when you need to move a heading and its contents to another position in your document. Within the Navigation pane, Word makes this a simple task. In the Headings tab, you can click to select a heading and then drag and drop it into the new position you want it to be placed in within the list of headings. Word will move the heading and everything between it and the next heading to the new location. Note that you would still need to rename the heading if required. For example, if it is a chapter heading that you are working with and you moved Chapter 1 to below Chapter 3, Word would not rename the heading, it would only move the content and the heading within the document. The Pages tab will display a thumbnail representation of all the pages your document contains. You can click a thumbnail to display that page in the work area. The results tab will show the results of any search that you started within a list. You can click on any item in the results list to be taken to that location in your document. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.